Claudia Jordan revisits a $1 million duplex with Agent Kendall. All right, guys, we're back at the house for a second look. Before I put an offer in, I had to bring KJ here to see what he thought, and we're seeing it. He first was like, do you want to spend this much money in the house? And then he came to see it, and now he thinks what? What do you think? I think it's a beautiful house. Of all the houses we've seen? Of all the houses we've seen, this is the best one. Best one. Uh, anything you want is huge. Okay. So we're going to take y'all on a tour again. Everyone on my IG said, get it. Is that a bust down chain you have? No. You got a bust down chain? Who are you now? Chain time? You can't fly on me? Okay. So what about this space? Let's speak on the space. It's all screened in. I didn't realize that yesterday. Yeah, it's all screened in. I guess it's supposed to be an outdoor space. So you got the, uh, like the Ikea tiles down here. I'm assuming if it gets wet, the water is not rain somewhere. Uh, yep, because they got a water connection. This could actually be turned into a whole other space if you blast all of these. Um, would you glass this in? No, I, I think I would leave it the way it is. And just use it as an outdoor space. So if you want to grill upstairs, you can still come down here. Someone says I want to do a retreat there, Women for the Culture. You know, I, might, I was thinking about getting this and have Airbnb and rent it out sometimes. I think this would go for... People would spend money to stay here. There's so much good stuff to do here. So that's all screened in, guys. So no mosquitoes. Well, there's a little space right there. But but this is a gorgeous space. It just needs to put some furniture in here. He did. He paid attention to every detail. I just found out the floors, the, and the marble floors in the bathroom are heated. Yeah. Heated floors. I would change the furniture in this room, of course. What's up, Talis? Should I get it? I'm gonna get rid of that. But this is, keep a pool table here? Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Another bedroom? Yeah. Right. I need a Miss Pac-Man machine here. <laughs> And they, uh, those, of course, are automated electric blinds. So you just hit the button and it just, the shade comes down. This reminds me of uh, my apartment in LA, in Playa Vista, on steroids. <sighs> we gotta make a decision by five o'clock today. I gotta decide, because that's near. Side in the office. Thoughts on the wall? Thoughts on the wall? Look at the little gold trim around the window. They have Attention, it's all good. 25 foot wall. 25 foot wall. Yeah. Marble. That's, I wonder how much that costs. The wall or the curtains? The wall. <laughs> what do you think that upgrade costs? Uh, these probably go for, well, you can do the math actually. What is it? Probably um, $49 a square foot. Mm -hmm. So if this is 15 feet wide by 25 feet high, you can do the math on that. I can't do the math on it. I lost track. Oh, yeah. 10, 10K? 20? Just for that wall? And then the labor, and then look at the little gold trim around there. And those lights. Look at that, how high it is. I need to know who this guy is that bought this place and flipped it like this. He is the sh How? Oh, you saw my post?
There's Caitlin, the realtors. Hi. Hi. He was like, what about this house you like so much and to want to pay that much money? Because we looked at other homes. Yeah. And I was like, you have to see it. In person. In person. Amazing. Because yeah. the pictures are great. Okay, I didn't show you all this yesterday, but this is a freezer. This whole thing is a freezer. And then this whole thing is a refrigerator. Like, come on. Do you see all the comments? There was so many people in the comments. They're like, get that house. Yeah. They like it. Yeah. I was like, let me not put the address where they come try to scoop it up. <laughs> right. So scale of one to 10. Yeah, okay. And yeah, I like that huge oversized. Like these, even the video doesn't know justice of what it looks like in person. Gotta be. He's got all this underlit, you know, lighting. Yeah, like the little. He put a, like every little detail. He he took care of like all those lights up there. Right. So he wants this painting, right? Yeah, yeah. Those two paintings and then the office furniture, everything else can stay. Why these really expensive? Yeah. I like the black doors. All right, let's take a more look at that. Um. Wait, did I look here yet? Oh, So, I'm gonna show y'all the details in the bedroom. That curtain, and he has lights everywhere. Like, he has, like, everything's lit. So, it's... And once again, these floors are heated. And look at the doorknobs. Have you ever seen that before? See that? Like it's a little busy, but it's still cool. Very masculine. I need a bigger closet than this for my shoes, though. Just saying. Like that. This is in Dallas. Uh, what would you call this area? Dallas. <laughs> I know it's Dallas. And then look at the lights. Another marble wall. All the fixtures, gold. This is bomb. KJ. Hey, What's up? What's up, what? Yes, y'all in my face, what? what you want? Are you not a realtor? Nah, not right now. Really? You're gonna be shy and trying to get you business? Yeah. You stalking me? <laughs> I'm sorry, I was trying to get you business. I'm trying to tell people to use you, but you're being shy, so. Alright. Okay. So you just signing by 5 o'clock today? On Labor Day and the holiday when all the banks are closed. <laughs> and I would do white sheer curtains too if you want to lighten it up. Since it is darker, so I'll do white sheer. Mm -hmm. I like those curtains. They're dramatic. dramatic. Pull off for today. You know? Wanna do your real to talk? Yeah, I'll talk to you. <laughs> okay. Thank you. You're so welcome. Thank you guys for coming. Yeah. This is your house. I feel it. I feel like it's good tonight. Like I love everything about it. Mm -hmm. You know? I love everything about it. So it checks all the boxes. Cool. Where the cats go? Backyard. Anyways. <laughs> Thank you.
Oh, I didn't show y'all the garage yesterday. Let me show y'all the garage. This garage. This guy paid attention to every detail. Like, come on, look at the floor in the garage. Even the floor is, like, everything's fly. Everything's fly. And this room is way bigger than it looks on camera. Like, it's a huge room. You like that? This is a big room. So we have to go back to one other place to compare this. Wow, this is so fresh in my head. That's what I said. Another area we would, I would screen in this area. Make another seating area. It'd be a great studio. He's got, oh, it's a screen though. This curved screen is everything, look at that. Like curved. Yeah, I'll just put some backgrounds up. Podcast in here, broadcast in here. It's bomb. And then this is another bedroom here, but it's not. He had furnished this bedroom. This would be my dressing room. Could be your dressing room? Yep. Prep room? More clothes. Yep, more clothes. This feels like a studio. Let's get out of here. Big step. It really is. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. y'all think do you love it <clears throat> I'm a crazy mess okay so The price is nine fifty nine, right? Yeah. Nine fifty nine. Is that a lot? Yes, that's a lot. But it's nice that it's already finished. You know, I mean, it, it, it was cheaper before. The guy put a lot of money into it, taking good care of it. He'll probably throw in a lot of furniture if you give him a full offer, which all that furniture is. Uh, restoration hardware, the top top of the line, like those chairs and couches were probably ten thousand mm -hmm. dollars, you know, and that's just for the couch. So there's a lot of everything in there is high end finish, um, and being that you're going from a smaller place to a larger place, that that might benefit you to just say, hey, can you just throw it all in? Because mm -hmm. he doesn't want to keep it. Right. So the full offer, so they probably keep it all, let you keep it all. You could literally just move in. And bring your clothes. Mm -hmm. Like it's not. There's nothing that needs to be. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yeah, it's just um, expensive. I think he's fair on the upgrades. Yeah. Like I don't think he tried to gouge. Like I think he's asking for pretty much what he put in. Because mm -hmm. look, that wall alone saying that's probably like forty thousand dollars for that marble wall, and then the bathroom wall. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm thinking, and then there was like the wood. There was um little details and all the lights and stuff. Mm -hmm. I could see him spending $200,000 on that house mm -hmm. on, the, on, on upgrades. Yeah. You know? Yeah. <laughs> like her shoes are cute. So, all right. So should we go look at the other place real quick to yeah. compare let's, let's while go, it's fresh uh, in the mind? Yeah, let's go take a look at it. And then see, okay, is this worth this compared to what Something else that doesn't have upgrades but has as much space. And it's cheaper. And it's cheaper. We really can't talk them down because 
they, they have, have multiple offers. They have more than one offer, so yeah, to and, get it, and, I would. And it just hit the market. So they're not desperate to sell it. Um, the guy that's in there has plenty of money. I'm sure he can wait for the right offer to come along. So I wonder how much lower than the asking that they put in already. Yeah, you just have to throw something at it and hope it sticks. Yeah. All right, we'll off to the next place so we can compare. But I, I actually, I love it. I think it's fly as hell. And it would make me want to have people over all the time to like entertain. You know, so many cool areas. All right, next place. Thanks for tuning in to Nine Mag TV.